I think we're live, Bruno. No, we're not. I can't see live. You can't see live anywhere? No. Once this little blue button up here says, yes, please. I think that it's all happening. Excellent connection today. That's good. Wow. Hello, everybody. Hi. We don't have another device saying comments and things. It's over here. Okay. I can see Samantha's here already. Hi, Samantha. Welcome. Welcome. Kylie Vitucci. I think we're live. Bruno. Ah! <laughs> the sound's on, so we're definitely live. <laughs> That's how we know. The back of my earring's not on properly. I, I better put that on. They're such cute little earrings. I didn't feel like anything big today. Just little. Thanks, Mimco. Thanks, Mimco. That wasn't a... Endorsed. endorsed. <laughs> so how is everyone? When you jump on, say hello. Melissa's here. Hi, Melissa. Melissa, Hi, Melissa. you are pumping out some beautiful cards. I stinking love them. Melissa. I'll be contacting you later. I have a little assignment for you. Oh. Because <laughs> I love your work. It's so good. <laughs> Luann, thank you for your help, Luann, on the page. You're such a darling. She was helping everyone out. They had questions. It. Yeah. Thank you. You're all over it, girl. Yeah, you're smashing it. So um, we're here with Bruno Batucci today. That's me. And Bruno's going to be doing a card today that was a bit stalkerish, if you ask me. No, I was with him. And Rachel Tessman, we were on leadership. Hi, Rachel. And Rachel was wearing the most beautiful top, gorgeous colours. And Bruno's like, <gasps> Instead of listening to what Rachel's informative... I was listening as well. He was, actually. He was doing everything. And it was very short. Because he's annoying. He and I did a screenshot. <laughs> I got everything. <laughs> he's a man of many skills. Um, but he's like, I'm going to case Rachel's top. And he did. Do you want to show the card? This is the piece of resistance. Piece of resistance. Now, I'm going to I'm gonna just scooch on over here because I want to show you Rachel's top. I know you all want to see it, don't you? Um, so funny story about this card. It's um, the technique is apparently called Joseph's coat. Obviously, have something to do with the biblical Joseph. But I thought I made it up myself. <laughs> Britta thought he was so I'm clever. Like, you know what I should do? I should do like daubering, and then I'll do clear embossing over the top, and then I'll do another color. I'm like, wow, oh, you're a genius. I've invented something, and Kylie's like. A no, duh. That's, that's right. That's called um, <laughs> Joseph's coat. What are the colours on Joseph's coat, Kylie? On yours? No. Um, oh, here we go. <laughs> We're going to sing a song. Here we go. Tell me the colours, Bruno. It was red and yellow and green and brown and usher and black and ochre and peach and ubi and white. And you're, making up, you're making up colours now. Um, I can't hear what... That's from the song, from the stage musical. <laughs> I didn't just make up that song. I sounded good. Now, Kylie, you're going to show the top that... I am. So here we go. Oh, why is it showing a different screen? Where's my Where's my display screen gone? It's disappeared on me. Hang on. Please wait me. Please wait. It will return. Oh, here it is. So this was the... Post on our blog that Bruno did. Boo -boo. And okay. here is Rachel. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? Amazing. And then that's the case. That's a pretty good replica, Bruno. It's a Bruno. pretty good replica, I have to admit. Yeah. Like if even I her, do even her gold necklace, that was channeled in the gold. Oh, hello. That was channeled in the gold um, forever gold foil that you that's used. That's right. Brilliant. You're you're a champion. So, um, after we posted this card, um, I wasn't going to make a video, but there was some people asking if I could. <laughs> there so was a lot of begging. Here I am. So, I'm going to make this same card using different colours, of course. And the colours that I'm going... Can I start now? Yeah, of course. And the colours that I'm going to be using are inspired by a different suite in the catalogue. The... Um, is it playing with patterns? Playing with patterns. Ah, oh, good. So I'm going to be That's using That's our tutorial these four bundle colors. this month. So these are the four colors that I'm going to be using. So now, if we go to our face down camera. Everyone said bang on, Bruno. 
Bang on? Yeah. They were really, really impressed with you. Thank you. So we've got our face down camera now. We do. Good. So this is the stamp set we're going to be using. These are the four colours. So the four colours are Night of Navy, Coastal Cabana, <laughs> um, we Calypso, say Cabana, Calypso Coral, and Crushed Curry. So they are going to look really neat. Now, in addition to... Oh, there's some glue here. I wonder where that glue's <laughs> from. Well, I was surprised that you didn't change the... Um, the sheet I'm so that's using, nothing to do with me i'm going to i didn't notice it until now <laughs> i'm going to be using some sponge darbers i'm going to be using some forever gold and that's it very nice so let's get underway i have a piece of cardstock i have a piece in thick whisper white as well as normal whisper white which one do you think i should use I think I'll use normal. It's easier to What's scan. the other one? Thick Whisper White. Oh, thick. Shimmery would also be really good for this technique, um, but you don't have it out, do you? No, I'm not going to use shimmery. But that's another one that people forget about. Don't forget your shimmery, peeps. Don't forget your shimmery. Shimmery peeps. White Stock is really good for sponging. Whoops. Let's use this one. Oh, what? They all dirty? No. <laughs> I was looking for that the right size. That surprised me. Oh, okay. Um, no, I'm not going to do that first. I'm going to do the daubering first. Thanks for... Dauba, dauba, dauba. Now. So, there's a lot of... Ooh, look at that. No, it's so cool, isn't it? So, the colours that I'm... I'm not going to be daubering in this colour. Night of Navy. Because I'm going to be using that in the back. So, the daubering is just going to be in the background. So, I'll do one colour at a time. Hi Ruth then. Hi Jenny. And crushed curry is this one here. Hey it's Kerry, how's one. your colour? Kerry just did a colour in her hair. Really? Yeah. She did a box colour. A box colour? Yeah. So this is about how um, scientific it is. Just a blob over there. A blob over here. A blob over here, and maybe a bit more over here, a bit more over there, a bit more over there. And I'm just going to be applying these three colours. Simple? Simple. Simple. <clears throat> and it looks so ugly. Thanks for that. <laughs> it really does. I'm like, really? Is that going to turn out to this beautiful card? Maybe. It's amazing. Oh, our um, update through emails just come through that we're live on YouTube. So we Thank might you, see a YouTube. few more people jumping in now. We've got 76 here at the moment. Thank you, 76 people. Yeah. Uh, oh, Christine's aunt in New Zealand has just died. I'm so sorry, Christine. That's awful. Our friends, it's so sad, but our friends are putting down their doggy today. Mm. Oh, so sad. I think we'll have to make sure that we get a card for them, actually. Maybe they can have this one. Yeah, that'd be nice. And this colour here is, I forget which one this was, Calypso Coral. Yep. <clears throat> I think this one's a bit... Sue's here for the first time live, and she's from Colgate, Wisconsin. Wow. Mm. Welcome, Sue. It's lovely to have you here. I want to pay you to make a sponge dauber holder. <laughs> so, actually, this mm. sponge dauber holder, yeah. this is actually a 3D printed. This is a printed, new one. This is a different one. This is a 3D printed insert mm. that goes inside the Stampin' Up! case. So, yeah. Kylie can put... I don't know if she sells to overseas, so I'm okay. gonna to have to ask her. I've been meaning to, I've been wanting to ask her for ages, um, whether she, yeah. I'll I'll ask now, and then hopefully by the end of this we'll find out. So um, that's about. I mean, it looks pretty ugly, don't you think? Yes, really ugly. And I might do some of the... <laughs> 
Do you like my honesty? Yes, so ugly. It's the only time I'm allowed to say anything of yours is ugly, so I'm taking advantage of it. <laughs> Remember that most of it's going to be covered, so yeah. it doesn't really need to be super... Um, I might just do a bit more of the this. Oh, yeah. Cool still cabana. Cool still. It's just so that you can say cool still cabana. 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 It's like Dolce and Gabbana. <laughs> I think this is a bit dry, this one. I've got some refills okay. there. Yep, and a bit more. So that's it. Fantastic. So well, that seems simple so far. All I will need that um, those three colours for. So now what I'm going to do is something illegal. Ooh, you are living on the edge. I'm going to use that. Is that I, okay? I still use it because um, I want Stampin' Up to bring them back. <laughs> <laughs> so bring it back, retired. Stampin' Up. <laughs> this here is retired. Um, <laughs> but I can't live a, without it. But it's great. Um, it's yeah. It's an embossing buggy. You can so apparently make your own. This step here is very important yeah. if you do this. Because what you want to do is you want to make sure this ink is dry. And you don't want any of the embossing powder, the emboss, um, what's that stuff called? Versamark to stick to this. Well, it's more the ink, isn't it? You just want to keep them separate. So, and if you want, you could, um, do a bit of a, um, of this to make sure it was dry, but it's pretty dry. I'm pretty confident that it's dry. It says you can push cornstarch. Cornstarch is how you make your own embossing buddy. Wow. And you can just use like a little sheet. Thanks for whoever. Yeah. There's a lot of videos if you want to go and find them. So what I'm going to do now is going to stamp, using some Versamark, I'm going to stamp these images here. So I'm going to use um, this stamp. I'm going to use the bubbly one, which is this one. And I'm also going to use... Uh, this one here. I could use all of them, but I won't. I just, yeah. So let's just stamp away. Any rhyme nor reason? No. Just chuck it on there. How do you see where you're stamping? You just got to keep an eye out. You got to remember what like what section you've done. I'll be able to see it, but oh won't yeah. Be able to see it. Oh, you can still see. Yeah, from here you can see it. This is such a cool technique. So, Let us know if this is the first time you've seen Joseph's so coat before. I'm not before. sure if you can see that little... No, you can't see it. But I can see it. There's one there and there's one there. I can see it this side. The camera's not picking up on it, though. So, let's do this one. And this one... Carrie loves this stamp set. It is pretty cool. Yeah. I love this whole suite. Like the gold. Yeah, it's so pretty. The paper. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. I'm in love. Did you all see my note cards? I did note cards using this paper the last couple of days. Christine used talcum powder. Ball puff. Uh, puff ball. Clever. Very clever. I like that. Hashtag bring back the embossing buddy. Thanks, Christine. Yeah. <laughs> you just sold me yet another item, Carrie said. <laughs> We're enablers. Now, I'm just going to do one more in there. Oh, it's the first time Anne-Marie Parra has seen this oh, technique. Good. First time for Lisa. Good. Carrie said you should make a Moses-inspired card next week. Mm. <laughs> With a, Would that be the water? <laughs> the splitting of the sea? A, a rock? <laughs> water come out of a rock. <laughs> water inspired. <laughs> okay, so that's the stamping. Let's just have a look. Yeah, I think most of it is going to be pretty covered. There's a bit over here that is a bit blank, but that's okay. And that's all that we'll do for that. 
Now, I'm just going to get some copy paper. Hey, Darcy. It's the first time seeing you live. Oh, thank live. you. She's from Sandy Hook, MB, Canada. Where's MB? Manitoba. Ah. Bruno knows these things. I don't know any of the acronyms. Now, um, something that's very important is for this design, which I think you can see me, yeah. Show it it's again. Okay. No, that's fine. Okay. Bing! For this design. For this design. I could have just done it here. That's all right. <laughs> um, you need to use clear embossing powder clear let's be clear about the clear now this is clear i think so the it, new one is a bit um the label's a bit different oh yeah but the purpose of that is so that you can see through and that's what we want we want the colors to see through so that later on when we use the um knight of navy over the top of it um we yeah the colors come through does that make sense? Yep. That's good. And if it doesn't, we're about to find out. And if it doesn't, there's how many people live watching? <laughs> there's now 97. 97 people. <laughs> Welcome. Whoa. And there's a lot of people here. That Oh, Sylvie's here from Quebec. We love our Quebec followers. We have lots of people from Quebec. I wish I knew us. how to speak Quebecois. Yeah, it would be wonderful, wouldn't it? I wish I knew how to speak any other language other than English. We attempted Hindi. I've attempted Japanese. Brenna knows a bit of German. <laughs> um, Kylie's being very modest. She can speak a lot of Japanese. No. Is anyone from Japan watching? I don't know any of the grammar. Like, coming, going, yeah. Ikimashita, ikimasu. Oh, you can see that. That so looks great, Brenna. I'll just do a bit more. And Bruno would be able to learn Italian in about a week if we went to it if we lived in Italy. He understands it, but just doesn't speak it because I think his grandparents made fun of him. Did they make fun know, of you? I don't know where you got that from. I don't know why you, you don't say speak it all Italian the time. then. <laughs> I'm like, why don't you say it? <laughs> I'm embarrassed. I'm like, oh, I wish I knew half of what you knew. I'd be like making it up all over the place. He sounds so good when he speaks Italian. So I will just put that aside. And now we're going to use some... What does this do, Bruno? What's the heat gun for? The heat gun is melting the embossing powder to the... So cool. Back in the day, you could use a toaster, <laughs> but my neighbour used a toaster and dropped the paper in the toaster and it went on fire. So don't use a toaster. <laughs> I wish we had like tweezers or something. Um, we've got I saw some Jennifer here. Maguire was using. You can use that this one if you like. For, <laughs> this is designed for right-handed people, isn't it? This setup. Yes, of course. Because I'm, I'm right-handed. <laughs> I still get excited every time I do embossing. I do too. It's so much fun. And it's it I used Whoa. to think it was really scary, but it's really not. Now has everybody got the um share sunshine in um the box of sunshine. Box of sunshine. Paper pumpkin. Paper pumpkin. If you live in Australia and you haven't got it yet, it is beautiful. So Kylie's just going to post a link to our online store. I am. And um, you can get it. If you live in Australia. If you live in Australia. This is good for people who haven't crafted before. Yeah. We've sent them to our friends and we haven't received any... Um, any indication that they've made them yet. Oh, but no, I'm doing a little craft class with them. Oh, good. I've teed it up for next Saturday because we sent it to some of our teenage friends. Our friends' daughters we sent it to because I think at this time they need all the support they can get, particularly in that 16 to 20 age group. I think, yeah, keeping an eye out for them during this time is really important. So I'm doing a Zoom catch-up with them. 
didn't know that. Yeah, next Saturday. And we're going to make the, the kit together. Yeah. So that'll be fun. They need they need some uh, something different to their normal that makes wow. life exciting. This and we might even really we might even play that game that I got the what is it called Jack Jackbox. Jackbox. We can play it on Zoom and have a game together as well. Okay, so let's go the embossing powder there. So that is heat embossed. You can see that now. You get, oh, yeah. 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 You can see that. Mm-hmm. So the next step is using these sponge darbers. <laughs> How do we say it? Sponge daubers. Daubers. And so this takes a bit of rolling. <laughs> so this is going to take a while, everybody. So please be patient. What? That looks so good. That looks so much better than I ever expected. Wow. wow. It looks like Bird of Paradise, Bruno. Streslicia Regina. That's really nice. Now, unfortunately for all of you, I'm going to keep going. So you saw in this one that that's almost solid, that colour. And I'm going to keep going until you can't see any of the other colours. So just talk among yourselves for a moment. <laughs> Or two, or three, or five. Rachel's here. Rachel Tessman. Tessman. No way! <laughs> she must have heard us talking about her. I promise I didn't even message her. I was like, ah, oh, I won't bother Rachel. <laughs> this is Rachel. This Rachel's is inspired top. by we, you. We already shared a picture of you, Rachel. <laughs> yeah, Bruno's doing a different version today. Not based on your top that he stalked. <laughs> so pretty. M Melissa said, great idea using the brayer. I always use sponges and it takes forever. This is kind of a spongy brayer, which still takes, takes a long time. But it's better than probably sponging. I'm really lazy with this and I actually get my whole ink pad and just chuck it on top. <laughs> I'll literally <laughs> dip it in so the So you ink. can see here, I didn't quite stamp it over there properly. So that is going to be covered by the sentiment. Oh, yeah. But I think it looks really good. I think it gives it sort of a rustic feel. What do you reckon? Do you reckon that's covered enough? Yeah, I love it. Chop it. <laughs> There's some tissues if you want to wipe off the. Oh, thanks ink. for that. You're welcome. Because it just pops. As soon as you do that, I'm so what? excited. It's just like, wee! I'm here! Oh, so good. Hey, Tina! Now you can see that that's a bit misstamped over there. So maybe I'll just get some extra. I think it looks great. Anyway. And you could fine. always chop down if you wanted to. I could. Yeah. But Slightly. So that's the stamping for that part of the card. <laughs> now, I need your help, everybody. The card base that I'm going to use is Knight of Navy. See how cool that looks together. I um, love the Knight of Navy. But I'm not sure about the other colour that I'm going to be using. So let's... See what you all think. Everyone's, <laughs> everyone's laughing at me that I'm like, I'll just shove my ink pad in it. <laughs> so I'm going to have an intermediate layer. Are we going to have it <laughs> yellow? Ooh, that hey, Caitlin, nice. good to see you here. Are we going to have it yellow? Are we going to have it cool still cabana? Hi, Rhonda. Wow, that looks cool. Oh, Linda said, wow, I didn't expect to see that design. This is new to me. Thanks, Bruno. Or should we have Calypso? Give me a, give me a look at um, Coastal again. I love Coastal. That looks really Do you cool. like cal Calypso? Um, I am going for... <gasps> oh, that's very pretty. What do you think, everybody? This one? Yeah, I think that one's nice. It might take them a little while. In the meantime, you can get your insert ready. 
Well, my so answer. I'll, I need the answer to this because then the next part of the stamping. <laughs> Sharon said, try just Jade. <laughs> it's not even a colour that we can choose from, Sharon. <laughs> <laughs> we we'll use just Jade. Yeah, on everyone's line. saying coastal. Yeah, coastal it is. I think coastal's the go. If Melissa says coastal, I agree. I agree with Melissa. <laughs> yeah, Samantha, coastal. Elaine, coastal. Yay. Oh, thinking of you, Deb, brother. So many people have got fires near them. Oh, a few people said Calypso. But I think, yeah, I think Coastal's winning. I think Coastal. Oh, someone said bronze or gold. That would be a great idea. We'll we're do using that in gold, another card. We're using gold later on. Yeah. Um, now, what am I looking for? This. I'm looking for the embossing illegal body. embossing buddy. The illegal embossing buddy. <laughs> and I'm going to just stamp... Hello, <laughs> it's me. Yeah, I think I think the outstanding reply is definitely coastal. We agree. It really does pop. And for this one, I'm going to go back to white embossing powder. Do we still have black embossing powder? Um, I don't think it would go well on this. It's a shame we don't have... Oh, can we make our own Night of Navy embossing powder? <laughs> you know how you can do that? It's so good. Oops. I'll just scrape that bit off. Oh, it actually looks good. I thought it might be too light, the white on the coastal, but it looks good. You sound surprised. I am. I thought it would be too light, but it looks good. I think I'm channeling Coastal Cabana today. <laughs> I get it. I didn't even realise, but my phone is Coastal Cabana. Your phone is Mint Macaron. I thought it was Mint Macaron too, but it's more Coastal Cabana. Whoa! Wow, that's going to look hot. That was scratching. They wanted to come in. That looks so cute. On your bed. That okay. looks really good. So that is how it's going to look like that. And there's just one more. It does look very bird of paradise doesn't it? I did see that you got to Bronze Elite, Caitlin. We haven't done the announcement because we've been really slack this week. But congratulations! Woohoo! Yeah. So, the piece that I am looking for, so we could add a bit like that. Or we could add a bit, ooh, I think that part there. Yep, that's the part that I want. Do you mind if I cut one of these? That's what they're there for. If you love your gold forever foil, love it. Chop it. Chop it. Chop it up. Yep. So Such I'm a cool way to that. use that foil. So that's the piece that I want. I might have to do some more surgery on that. But the part that I want is just like so. <laughs> coastal, Coastal Cabana. I never knew that that's what they said next. The hardest spot north of Havana. Did you know that? Yes. Ah, oh, of course you did. You know your songs. Now it's just slightly a bit... Um, so if I cut that off. I can hear you singing. I know, so can I. I was like, how is that possible? Oh, it's because I just pressed the volume up. <laughs> okay. How does that look? Wow. Amazing. 
So what I'm going to do is do some now. Where did I put that? What would you like? I can get anything you like. Here it is. Here it is. Ooh. Look away, people. More illegal substances, Look but we away. need to bring this one back too. So that's why we're using it. <laughs> it is the best way to use that. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So I'm going to stick that down using... Let me guess. Dimensionals? Dimensionals. Oh, wow. I love it. Chop it. Actually, I'll stick the other piece down first. I'll stick this down to that. Mm-hmm. Christine said, yes, Brenna, you're a clever clogs. A clever clogs? Yep, clogs. Yeah, clever, clever clogs. Have you never like heard the that? shoes. My mum used to say that. Yeah, like the shoes. Mm. You're such a clever clogs. I don't know where that saying comes from, but... Wow, yeah. that really pops with the... Um, Coastal. Yeah. Coastal, Coastal Cabana. Cabana. Just going to stick it. Stick that you've, got, you've started something now, Rachel. Every time I use Coastal Cabana, I'm going to sing that song now. I never related the two. Of course, Bruno did, didn't you, Bruno? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, of course. <laughs> I sing it every time I pull it out. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Jessie has sung it too. Has she? Hi, Jessie. I miss Jessie. <laughs> she can't come to our house. Oh, are these big enough? Is this big enough for a normal size dimensional? I think so. If not, we've got some minis. this surgery this one's going to be a bit different because I don't have the gold um, the gold strip but that's okay yeah how can I do you reckon it'd be okay if I did it oh, well, I think I'll do it three quarters do you want to bring it over just a little bit towards yeah because it's yeah underneath your oh sorry I just touched something it was underneath your little profile yeah that looks good love it chop it <laughs> okay here we go <laughs> look away people look away I'm telling you look away <laughs> Oh, Carol says she's learning so much from you too, and she's an old stamper. So that's great. Um, Melissa, you spoke too soon. <laughs> she said, only four dimensionals. Who is this imposter? <laughs> Don't worry, he'll make up for it on this layer. <laughs> oh, I hope you try it, Linda, and please share it with us if you do. Send us a message. I'd love to see your version. Everyone's going to make fun of no, me. No, they won't. Because they're all very upset with your last one. They said, um, I think you can fit a few more dimensionals <laughs> on your last one, Bruno. <laughs> okay. Go, go, Bruno, go, go. That's what Emery said. Go, go, Bruno, go, go. Yeah. It's dimensional time. Oh, no, I can't use this because it has white paint on it. Does it? Yeah. Oh, let me wipe it for no, you. I've wiped it like five times. <laughs> I'll buy a new one. <laughs> we need a replacement. <laughs> Every time I wipe it and it still has white paint How on it. How does it have white paint on it? I used I it yesterday. Someone must have used white paint on it. Who would that have been? It wasn't me. Are you sure about that? Look. White paint. That's so weird. 
It was from that time when you were doing the um, magenta <laughs> the, the madness. Block, the block's still over there. Yeah, I know. The block is there. <laughs> <laughs> have a competition. How many dimensionals did Bruno just put down? It's <laughs> uh, gold. Okay, I think I really do think it's safe now. <laughs> well, Rachel, that's what we've got some, and that's what he should really use. What the sheets? Yes. No, it's not big enough for the card stuff. No. I'm <laughs> It's a good idea. I it is a very good that. idea. He needs to do that for layers. Just use the entire sheet. I, I can't agree. believe Rachel's still here. Aww. Of course she's still here. You're very interesting to watch. If you need a Stampin' Up! demonstrator in, a, in the US, US Rachel Pittsman. <laughs> Rachel can help oh, you. Oh, that's not straight, but that's okay. Oh, that's pretty straight. That would be my straight, not your straight. What do you straight. think, people? Wow. So, do we have some of those inserts cut? Yes, pre-cut inserts. We love those. That looks amazing. <laughs> Should I do some stamping on the inside? Yes, Why always. Not? It's always nice to have a little bit of stamping on the inside. Actually, I'll do it using Coastal, Coastal <laughs> Cabana. The something, something, something. Havana. I thought you knew. I thought you knew that bit. You said you knew that bit. No, you asked <laughs> if I made the connection. Ah, uh, no, it's the. I never knew the just north of Havana bit. What is it? The hottest spot north of Havana. Mm. I love it. What do you think? Ah, <gasps> so pretty. Yeah. Now. The last. Yeah, I love how the colour combo came out too, Samantha. It's true. It's beautiful. Alison loves the gold touch to the card. And that, my friends... Whoopsie. <laughs> that was it. That is it. Wow. They are gorgeous. Thank you, Rachel. And Arlene said, it's good. No nudie runs. No nudie runs. Nudie! Who did I say that to? Oh, Shannon West. I said something about nudie runs and she goes, what's a nudie run? <laughs> And how do you explain what's a nudie run to Shannon West? <laughs> so, I was like, for our ah. American friends, do you understand what a nudie run is? No, I don't think they know what a nudie run is. I've never done a nudie run. Well, as kids. <laughs> Excuse me? I think you have. <laughs> as children, we as do. As kids, like, you'd, like, run from the bath to yeah. to the to get dressed yeah. in the room or something like that. And that was called a nudie run. Yeah, that was the nudie run. So that's the card. <laughs> Is there anything else you want to tell our um, friends? I think that's everything. Was there any other extra Do bits and come pieces? Change the. I'll change it. So wait, actually, take your strip. photo. Yep. And I'll I'll move out because I want it to just be you. Put both of them up. Do both. Yes. And a bit higher. <laughs> okay, got it. Yeah. <laughs> That's nuts. <laughs> it's so much easier. That becomes that becomes our photo, the cover photo. It's all about saving time around here. We're too busy to be taking other photo shoots. Um, so what else do we have to talk about? The box of sunshine. Box of sunshine. I will pop that up. Did you pop it up? No. I was gonna do the external link through DBWS, but it's taking a very long time. <laughs> Because <laughs> I wanted to add the block, just in case people don't have the block. All right. Because that's the, that's the only thing. If you're new to stamping, that is totally the place to go. If you're brand new. And we have had a lot of new ones join mm. us in the last... Even yesterday, someone messaged me and they're like, I have never made a card ever. What do I need? And I'm like, oh my goodness, where do I start? So... Yeah, it's quite challenging. You need the big shot. I mean, the... <laughs> the scam. <scam. laughs> 
She wants the skin. But I said, you don't really need that to begin with. If anything, it's the trimmer you need to begin with. So, it yeah, it took, took me by surprise. I was like, oh, I have to think, like, very basics. And it's really just cardstock ink, a stamp set that's versatile, and the trimmer. Mm. So I might, have to, I might have to do, like, a little DBWS shareable where it's like, are you a beginner? Have you never crafted before? These are, these are the products that would be good for you. Something like that. Because it is, yeah, we've got a lot of opportunity during this time. People are at home more. They want to look for a hobby. And this is a beautiful hobby because not only do you get to craft and have fun, but then you get to give it to someone too. And then you share love at a time where we need to share love more than ever. So... Yeah, that's been exciting. And we've also got the um, joining special that's on at the moment mm. where you get 16 um, card kits and you get two free stamp sets and a pack of rhinestones. In addition to your normal yeah. whatever you pick. Yeah, so you can get that on top of. So if you have any questions about that, we've had four people join with us in the last... How, what date is it? The 10th? Yeah, in 11 days we've had four people join up. So that's been lovely. Some of our old team members have come back. So if you've been a demonstrator in the past, now it might be a great time. Mm. If you join now, how long do you get to stay for? What month is it? <laughs> so if they join in September, they get... Um, so what's the quarter? January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, Indeed. September. Okay, so they, they get October, November, December... And then pending month, January. Mm. So you, you're going to be a demonstrator guaranteed until the end of Jar January if you sign this month. And celebration will have started and a new catalogue will have come along. So it's a good time to look at joining, especially when new catalogues come along. Ah, why not? Yes. Um, so Alison asked a good question. Is Paper Pumpkin only available to demonstrators, Bruno? No. Anyone can buy that. Anyone can buy that. In Australia, from us. Yeah. Um, it's a one-off here in Australia. Uh, in North America, it's available as, as a subscription service. Mm. And this paper pumpkin, which I'll just reach back and get. Yeah, it's very cute. We love this paper pumpkin. Unfortunately, we've sent out all the cards, so we can't show you <laughs> what the cards are. But it comes in a box like this and has everything that you'll need to make 16 cards. Eight. Eight cards. But Eight. there's lots of leftover. Lots of leftover. And you, you can just, use that for oh, other... Oh, this is the stamp set. This is really cool. Yeah, so, that's the stamp um, set. Can you see that? Yeah, it's a bit... Anyway. Um, Probably here. I'll do this. I think it's, you can see it like that. So it's got hello... Like, really good sets there. Even that one there. A little something to brighten your day. Although, I think it's the other way around. Sorry. I'm like, why is it looking so strange? Yeah. Maybe. So, you just need a clear yeah. block. And we can hook you up with one of those. Mm. But it comes in this box. And you'll love it. Mm. And we've we've given it to friends. And um, family sent it around. So, that they can do something with their teenagers and as a family. Which is really nice. Um... Yeah, so I don't think there was any other questions. We've got our tutorial for the month. Um, we're starting our training program again, so that's been really busy getting that set up. So if you're a demonstrator looking for support, we'd love to help you. If you have questions about that, we can pop a, pop the um, link up underneath or below, depending whether you're on Facebook or YouTube. We've got lots of videos coming in this week from demonstrators all around the world for our training program because we do a mashup. We know you don't want to just hear from us. <laughs> There's other people to learn from, right? <laughs> um, and I think that was, yeah, all of the latest news. Yeah. I'm trying to think if there was any other... I'm sure there'll be some exciting things coming um, up. Can I talk about this? Yes, what please do. What about your, do. your other cards that yeah. you made? Yeah. So we received from... It was Linda Driggs. Linda Driggs. We received this card, which was absolutely, absolutely stunning. stunning. Scrappy mm. strip. Yeah. Beautiful colour selection. Absolutely amazing. But then she also sent this. Did mm. you see that? So beautiful. 
Now, she called that the mosaic, mosaic technique. technique. Mm. And Kylie loved it so much that you might have seen on her blog. I even did a video on it. It's on YouTube. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? Yeah. So thank you very much, Linda, for yeah, that beautiful Yeah, thank you, Linda. Card. Apparently someone else has done it, but I haven't seen it anywhere else. But if you have a link or a person that you can send beautiful. us who came up with that very cool idea so we can thank them, because you need scrappy strips to begin with, and then you chop it down chop into the, the strips, to yeah. make it the mosaic, which is so clever. We love seeing these ideas where people take an idea that, you know, Maybe has been there before, but just adapting those ideas is really smart. We did not put those pieces in. Individually, no. Like, that's the cool bit. So go and watch the video, because the first time I saw it, I looked at it, I went, Linda, that's ridiculous. Really? Did you really put all those pieces together? No, she didn't. So go and look at the video. It's, it's very good. It's deceiving. Yeah. And this is the other one that I did. It's the other thing. This is the mini paper pumpkin box. And mm. so been decorated on the outside those mini paper pumpkin boxes make sure you get them they are the cutest and they're perfect for holding note cards they're so good and you can get the note cards in a pack of 20 they've already got envelopes they've already pre-scored for you and then they fit in this cute little box perfectly. Like, what a cool present during this give time. Give away the cards to... Yeah, so give the whole them. box. And then they can keep the box and use that for whatever they want. And then they can give away the cards to friends and family. So yeah. that's a really nice gift. Um, some people said it would be a great class. Absolutely. And it's simple. Mm. That's really simple. Simple stamping in that. Because it's mainly just give those designer away series paper. Yeah. How nice would that be? Beautiful. Nice. So, yes, yeah, so I think that's all we have to share with you. Thank you all very much for being here today. If you're not a subscriber, we'd love you to be one. Click the bell icon. Bruno subscribe. loves that. Bit. Subscribe and click our bell. <laughs> share with your friends. <clears throat> yeah, share with others if you think they'll enjoy Bruno's Joseph's Coat card today. And thank you, Rachel Tessman, for your inspiration. In my dazzling coat of many colours. How I love my coat of many colours. We knew we had to end colors. with a song, didn't we? Of course. Yes. So have a wonderful week. We shall see you sometime during the week. And if there's anything we can do to support you creatively, mm -hmm. from a business point of view, um, emotionally. <laughs> Some people like to talk. I'm happy. I'm happy for you to come and talk to me. It's a time where we need to... Yesterday was Are You OK Day. Are you OK? And if you're not, please talk to someone. It's really important. Really, don't struggle on your own. I had struggle days and I just ate a lot of cups. And then got angry that Bruno let me eat the cups. <laughs> so 